Hey, this is Rich over at TVP Live with another quick tips tutorials brought to you by Photoshop Elements Custom Tutorials Group. And let's jump right in with today's poster. Wanted to know how to create a custom clipping mask. And basically, all you got to do is create a custom shape and then change it into a mask. I'm going to show you two different ways to do it. The first way is how Elements wants you to do it. So let's go ahead and grab the lasso tool and we're just going to make a big old splat. In a splat, it doesn't have to be perfect but that's okay and once I let go that's our shape that we're going to create and then we're going to want to choose the paint bucket and then choose the color let's go to the color palette the front box here and choose black see right now it's set on red so we're going to drag that over to black down here and we'll hit okay that gives us a nice black palette and all we got to do is take the paint bucket and click right in the middle and with the magic of a better artist here's our splat it's a black splat over a white background and that's its own layer and next we want to fill in the black area which we call our mask with another image of the sky but in order to do that we want to get rid of the white now you might have a PNG that already doesn't have the white and that way you can skip this portion but in our place since we have the white we want to get rid of it grab the magic tool set the tolerance because these are nice sharp lines I don't know like 25% is good there As soon as I click here in the white I can hit delete and get rid of all the other little white pieces like that and that creates a mask or we can be saving it as a PNG this will help us go over to our sky grab the sky and drag that project into our current projects tab as soon as I let go here's our sky but I want it to fill in the whole shape so I'm going to put it at the top left here and drag the rest of the picture down to the bottom right and make sure I fill in the whole image with the sky and I'll hit OK and all we got to do is choose that sky layer which is on top of our black splat and come over here to layer and then come down here to create clipping mask watch what happens as soon as I click that with the left mouse button it creates a really cool mask and the best part about this is that I can grab that image in the background and I can move it around so if I wanted to make it a lot bigger like this and I can grab just the one color of the image or just the other color of the image or bring it back down and have it fit the whole image that's one way to create a clipping mask now let's go back to our original splat image with its own layer and I'm going to show you a different way the way I do it it's a little different grab the magic tool you can still use the 25% tolerance and I'm going to click instead of on the white on the black I'm going to click there and I'm going to hit delete and I'll get rid of the couple extras here one and two that leaves us the inner portion open now we can go back to our sky and like before let's go ahead and grab that sky image and bring it into our current project as soon as I let go boom there's the sky but it's in the wrong position of our layers all you got to do is come up here and drag it from the top layer to the bottom layer and now it's behind I can go ahead and enlarge the background so that it fills out the whole image and just like before we got the whole sky filling the background but now we got to do is get rid of the white in order to do that we want to marry these two and then delete the white so all you got to do is right click up here and hit merge down boom that makes it into one image now all you got to do is grab the magic tool once again click it on the white and hit delete and there we go we got us a nice clipping mask just like before get rid of these little white pieces here and that's simply another way to create a clipping mask and these are all custom made to your likings. Well, this is Rich calling it quits for this tutorial saying over and out.